This is a great project because turkeys specifically need the flatwoods for nesting. What we're trying to do is get these habitats back to their native state. It's supposed to be pine flatwoods in here. We actually brought in some mulching heads to come in here and mulch up woody shrubs. We had some bay trees come in, some gums, different species that belong in Florida but don't necessarily belong in this environment. This project is 88 total acres in Upper Hillsborough Reserve in Pasco County. By returning it to its native state, it makes it a better ecosystem for the wild turkeys and it makes it a better habitat for all other species here that are native to Florida. My name is Mark Maggard. I'm a land manager with the Southwest Florida Water Management District. Once we get the woody encroachment beat down, we run some fire through it and then everything rebounds within a month or two and we get a nice fresh start. This project is actually a cost share project in conjunction with the Florida Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission and the National Wild Turkey Federation. The primary focus of the Wild Turkey Cost Share Program in Florida is to help fund and provide direction on active land management on public lands. With the work that we're helping fund, we'll be able to get fire, prescribed fire, back into this area, which is very crucial to wild turkeys and other native wildlife in the area. One of the unintended side effects of COVID, the NWTF, they get a lot of their funds through fundraisers and banquets. We were concerned that maybe we, you know, we might lose a little bit of the funding for these type projects, but they were able to come through and pull together some money to help get this one done. So we're really glad to see that. It's great. Mark is a big advocate for the National Wild Turkey Federation. He's a very active land manager for the district and just wants to do the right thing. And without folks like Mark and others across the state, the work that we do and we help fund and facilitate, it wouldn't happen without them. This project really is a win-win for all of us. The district is aiming to get out here and get this back into its native flatwood state. The NWTF wants to, of course, make better habitats for turkeys, and FWC is looking to make better habitats for our native species. It's a great project all around.